I can't afford to live here anymore. That's what hundreds of tenants are now saying after they were kicked out of their apartments bought out by Covenant Capital. New at 6 tonight, News Channel 5's Kimberly Davis explains how the developer claimed to keep the rent affordable, but now the rent is increasing by up to 70%. Kimberly. Vicki, tenants tell me they've called Premier West home for the past several years, and now that the new management is finally making renovations, they're being kicked out if they can't afford the skyrocketed rent. It is very hard, you know, tough. It's one of the growing pains of living in the IT city, increasing rent, but not enough income to keep up with the cost. At least that's the case for Sigrida Daba. No, I cannot afford it, you know, it's expensive for me. I cannot afford it. Daba is just one of several tenants who've been told she has to get out. This comes after Covenant Capital Group bought out the Premier West Apartments. Tenants were given 30 to 60 days to move so that developers could start the renovations. Tenants are saying, hey, we've been here for 10, 15 years. We've been solid rent paying tenants and we've never really benefited from a significant renovation. And those tenants will never benefit from the new renovations unless they fork over some more cash. The current rent for a three bedroom apartment is one thousand one hundred twenty five dollars and the newly renovated apartments are being leased for $1,899. We have sent multiple emails. Tenants have called on the phone. News Channel 5 has also made several requests for on-camera and phone interviews, but we were told no one is available to speak. But when the tenants didn't get a response, they held a rally outside of Covenant Capital Group's office demanding answers. Essentially, we were told we're going to do a housing fair at Prestige Point, um, and that's all we can do, and the door was slammed in our face. Without much luck, the tenants are now trying to find another place to call home while trying to make ends meet. Working people in Nashville who have really built the city and are contributing to our city's communities are being told, you don't have a right to be here anymore. Covenant Capital Group sent us a statement addressing some of those concerns. A representative says the rents at the property will be classified as affordable under Metro's guidelines based on Metro Nashville's median income. They also say anyone who needs help should visit the leasing office for assistance. Rory.